United States President Joe Biden said on Friday, November 4, 2022, that Elon Musk had bought the social media platform Twitter that spewed lies around the world. Twitter recently laid off half its workforce but said smaller cuts were made to the team responsible for preventing the spread of misinformation, as advertisers pulled out amid concerns about content moderation. And now what we're all worried about, Elon Musk is going out and buying a company that spews lies all over the world. There are no more editors in America. No editor. How can we expect children to understand what is at stake? Biden said at a fundraising event. Earlier, White House Press Secretary Karine Jean-Pierre told reporters that Biden had made clear the need to reduce hate speech and misinformation. That belief extends to Twitter, extends to Facebook and other social media platforms where users can spread misinformation, he said. Musk has promised to restore free speech while preventing Twitter from going down to hell, but big advertisers have expressed concern about the acquisition for months. On Friday, November 4, 2022, Twitter's head of security and integrity, Yoel Roth, tweeted that Twitter had laid off 50% of its employees. He said the social media platform's content moderation capability remains. Roth's tweet was to reassure users and advertisers after the company's takeover by the world's richest man Elon Musk last week. Roth said Twitter's top priority was continuing to fight dangerous misinformation. According to him, 15% of Twitter employees on the trust and security team, which is responsible for preventing the spread of misinformation and malicious content, have been laid off. Across the company, layoffs affect 50% of employees. Elon Musk tweeted shortly after Roth saying, once again, Twitter's strong commitment to content moderation remains completely unchanged.